Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. My name is Akshay, and my question to you is from GIS Queenstown campus, Singapore. Technology is moving rapidly into sports. Even cricket is using technology through third umpire decisions and Hawkeye. We are also adopting such technology in our new smart campus in Pongol called Spedas, which uses analytics to track gameplay in basketball. Sir, how do you think this, such technologies will shape the future of sports? When I was uh, started playing for India in 2000, December, so that time I was not believing in technology. And I'm very, I'm very gadget free guy, so I have all the gadgets in my house. All the latest mobiles, all the latest technology things which launched by Google or Apple or Samsung, so I have uh, in my house. But I never believed that technology can help the game. But this data analytics, it helped tremendously because every game you play, they'll record your bad performance, good performance. You played against which bowler, you score against which team, which bowler. And that uh, data will show you that you're good against Pakistan, you're not good against Bangladesh. You're good against South Africa, you're not good against England. Like whenever you watch the game, they will show you the performances of all the players. And I was not believing in 2000 December or maybe 2001. In 2003, 4 when our computer analyst guy came in and he showed me videos, he showed me different kind of uh, uh, datas and I got amazed. And in 2004, I invested money in technology and then the company name called Sports Mechanics. And I was the first investor. I just invested 20 lakh rupees and then a company is worth of I think 100 crore. So, the technology is used by everybody, everywhere. If you use in a good manner, then it will give you good solutions. Like, when I picked the Kings Learn Punjab team, so before the auction, I got all the data. So that KL Rahul, Karun Nair, Yuvra Singh, R. Ashwin, Mayank Agarwal, Finch, you know, their stats, they're good against on which ground, they're good against on which bowler, and accordingly, I picked my players because of data, because uh, uh, that data tells me that Finch can bat at top the order, Finch can bat at down the order, and he's very good when he's batting 16 to 20 overs. Yuvra Singh is very good when he batted after 12 overs. Ashwin is very good when he'll bowl in power play and in slow overs. And Mohit Sharma is very good when he bowl is in only uh, after 6 overs or before 14 overs. So that kind of data you'll collect from, you'll get uh, from the guys and you will use uh, uh, with your players and you can buy players and you can actually use your playing eleven. So we change the batting order because of data. So we uh, suppose uh, a foreign player like David Miller is supposed to bat at number five and data shows that if spinner comes his his performance against spin is, is not great. So you can change with the Indian player instead of sending uh, David Miller you can send Indian Akshar Patel who can utilize the spinners and hit more boundaries than the Miller. Welcome.